Let's make cloth napkin flowers to impress the pants off your dinner guests. Hi everyone, my name is Judy from Happy Holistics and today we're going to be folding some cloth napkin lotus flowers. So I'm not really sure how it came about, but lately I've been reading a lot about garbage and how much trash we produce, especially in North America. So I've been trying to do my part in order to reduce this amount. According to a quick Google search, we use 13 billion pounds of paper towel each year, which is over 45 pounds per person per year. That's a lot of paper towel. I honestly didn't know this statistic before I started making this video, but I am here to tell you that it's super, super easy to switch to cloth napkins. To get family, friends, and even strangers on board, I'm trying to avoid nagging them to death right off the bat and instead leading by example. I am hoping that maybe if I impress them enough with my mad origami skills that it'll lead to questions and maybe I'll direct the conversation towards cloth napkins versus paper napkins and then to the garbage talk. See? One part enviro, one part completely mental. Let's go! You're going to need a square cloth napkin. Mine isn't perfectly square so you'll see some wonky corners for sure. I don't care that much though since they're made to be disassembled and used. I'm going to start on the underside of the napkin. It's the side where the edges are folded inward and sewn. You can compare it to the top side which shows cleaner edges. Fold the corners of your napkin into the center to make a smaller square. Do this two more times on this same side. Then flip this whole thing over and fold all the corners into the center again, just one time only. Let's just take a quick look at the underside of this and you'll see all of these flaps that we've created earlier. These will become our petals in just a moment. Coming back over to the side that we were working on, I find that it's easier to work with by turning the four corners up as much as you can. Then hold down the center and carefully flip the first four flaps which are located right underneath these points. The second set of flaps are between each of these points. Flip those over as well. And finally, our third set of flaps are underneath the original four points. This last set really helps to keep the shape of your flower, so tug them up and in. And there you have it, cloth napkin lotus flowers. As a side note, these do look better in person than on camera, I swear. For a table setting, I'm thinking you can have a bunch of them just in the middle as a centerpiece. This might look really nice, especially if you have mismatched napkins. Another option is to place one of these on each table setting, and there you have it. If you enjoyed watching this video, please remember to hit that like button, as well as to subscribe to my channel so you never miss a single episode. Also, if you have any ideas on what I should be filming, please let me know in the comment section below. I will see you next next week. Please visit my website www.happyholistics.ca for more information.